Hello dear students, welcome to LFI Educates. In this video, we shall discuss about functions. So what is a function? Let A and B be two non-empty sets, then a rule F which associates to each X belongs to A. A unique element B of B is called a function and we write it as F is a function from A to B. So simply it means that every element of the set A must be connected to at least one element of the set B. So if I connect this D with the 4, will it be a function? No. Why? Because one element has been connected to more than one element in B. Again, if I write an element E here, will it be a function now? Again no, because the definition says that every element of A must be connected to at least one element of B. Fine. So let me remove this A. From this example, here what is the domain? Here the domain is the set A, and the codomain is the set P. That means the elements consisting of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and here the elements are A, B, C, and D. Now, what is the range of this function? The range means it is those it is the set of those elements which are connected to the elements of the set A. So here the ranges will be 1, 2, 3 and 5. Also, here 1 is the image of A. 2 is the image of B, 3 is the image of C and 5 is the image of D. Whereas A is the pre-image of 1, B is the pre-image of 2, C is the pre-image of 3 and D is the pre-image of 5. So from this we can see that this range is always a subset of the codomain. That means that here the elements are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and here the elements are 1, 2, 3, 5. So always we shall see that range is a subset of codomain. Also in some of the cases we shall see that range is equal to codomain. Next we have 1, 1 function. So a function f from x to y is defined to be 1, 1 or injective if the images of distinct element of x under f are distinct. That is for every x1 comma x2 belongs to x, f of x1 equal to f of x2 implies x1 equal to x2. So what does it mean? It means that every element of the first set or the domain must be connected to only one element of the codomain. That means distinct elements of the set A must be associated with distinct element of the set B. What if if I write a 5 here and connect the 5 with C, will it be a 1 1 function? No. This, such kind of functions are called many 1 functions where more than one element is connected to a single element. So if it is not a 1 1 function, it will be a many 1 function. So let us see an example. Let f be a function from the set of natural numbers to the set of natural numbers given by f of x is equal to twice x. Now we need to check that whether it is a 1 1 function or not. So how to do? At first from the definition we need to take x1 comma x2 belongs to the domain. So what is our domain here? It is a set of natural numbers. So let us take let x1 comma x2 belongs to the set of natural numbers that is the domain. Now such that f of x1 is equal to f of x2. So what is f of x1? So here f of x is given by 2x. So f of x1 will be twice of x1 and f of x2 will be twice of x2. Now. I can cancel out the 2 on both sides, so this leaves us with x1 equal to x2. So we have got this, that for all 
x f of x1 equal to f of x2 we have got x1 equal to x2 so hence we can say that this function is a one one function next on to function a function f from x to y is defined to be on to or surjective if every element of y is the image of some element of x under f that is for every y belongs to capital y there exists an element x in x such that f of x is equal to y okay let us change this as x and y according to the definition now what does a onto function say it says that every element of y must be associated with at least one element of the set x okay that means there should not be any element remaining behind that is not connected to any element of the set x clear so what if there is an element left here which is not connected to the set x then such type of function will be called into function but for a function to be on to every element should be connected to the set to the elements of the set x next we have bijective function so a function f is said to be bijective if it is both one one and on to so do we have such an function or have we got such a function yes just the previous function that is f x is equal to twice x that we have taken from r to r or so this function is both one one as well as on to so such a function is called bijective function so thank you stay home and stay safe